In this video, I'll show you the differences between already and already. They have the same sound, but already is an adverb and already is used as an adjective. Use already for some sort of expected time. If I make a question such as, are you done already? Are you done already? I expected that you would be finished or done later, but you did something early. You finished early. You are done early. In this question, are you finished already? The word already is used for this verb, so it makes it an adverb. And the expectation is that you would have finished later. But instead, you finished early. Are you finished already? We could put already at the end of the question, or we can put already in front of the main verb. Are you already finished? You finished something early. On a timeline, if I expected you to finish something at 5 o'clock, but instead you finished at 4.45, then I can ask, are you already finished? Use already to talk about a time that's before another expected time. By the time we arrived, the movie had already started. So this happened in the past, and this also happened in the past, but this is in the past perfect tense. This is a very common use for the past perfect tense to talk about something that happened before something else in the past. So on a timeline, this is when we arrived, and this is when the movie started. By the time we arrived here, the movie had already started. The movie started before we arrived. Here are some examples of ways you often hear already. We're already late. A decision has already been made. The show is sold out already. The show was sold out quickly. It's already sold out. When already is two words, it functions as an adjective meaning prepared. I'm all ready. This means that I'm prepared. I'm all ready to go. Here you can use an infinitive after already. This can change. You can use a different infinitive. We're all ready to leave. Here again is an infinitive. Are you all ready? Are you prepared for whatever the situation is? Here you can compare the two forms of already. It's two words here. Dinner is already. This means that dinner is prepared. And in this question, have you eaten dinner already? In this case, the question is expressing surprise that this happened. It happened before a time that was expected. We're all ready to begin. We're prepared to begin. We've already begun. This means that we started early. We started at a time that was earlier than expected. It's useful to contrast the use of already with the use of yet. Both of these are adverbs. 
they started already. So this happened early. And here, they didn't start yet. This is negative, And we use yet with the uh, negative. Don't say they didn't start already. You instead would choose the word yet. It's already here. This is early or before an expected time. And it's not here yet. So something has not arrived up until now. Notice that already can appear before here or after here. You could also say it's here already. Yet will usually appear at the end of the sentence or at the end of a clause. It's not here yet. When talking about time, it's already four o'clock. The time came quickly. It's not four o'clock yet. Perhaps it's 3.50 or 3.55, but not four o'clock. In these two questions, the change of one word makes a big difference. Is it four o'clock already? This is an expression of surprise. Is it four o'clock yet? This is a question asked because the person doesn't know what time it is. Is it four o'clock yet? 